Hi to you. I'm Nicole. I'm from southwest of Germany, Saarland, if you know this wonderful place. And I lived since 2005 in Zurigo, in Zurich, in Switzerland. And I'm a professional saxophonist touring around the world, not at the moment, as you can see. I'm sitting here for you. And I'm teaching online courses, online workshops to several topics like um, beatbox. I can show you. Something like this I'm, I'm teaching. And uh, I have already some students um, I can teach that nice technique. I teach double tonguing, triple tonguing. I teach improvisation, sound stuff, um, preparing the read, which is a pretty, pretty big topic. And um, I'm playing saxophone since 25 years. Yes, 25 years now. And it's always challenging me. It means you never stop to practice if you're playing saxophone. That's a nice thing. You're never bored by it. And um, mainly I'm. Um, playing jazz, popular music, and but I have a nice offer from a French orchestra in France to play some wonderful classical music. So I'm training very hard. So um, just to give you um, a little thing, when I started to play saxophone, my parents, because my first instrument was the piano, and um, my... Uh, father says because I wanted really to play the saxophone I, I saw a female saxophonist that was inspiring for me and I was like hey um I love I would love to play the saxophone and then you know if you are if you are 12 years old the parents may say oh yeah are you sure um but then um I said no I want to play saxophone I want to play saxophone so and I remember my father said, yes, okay, let's do it. We went to the shop and my saxophone looked like this, you know, and I said, no, I don't want to play this saxophone. I want to play this saxophone. <laughs> but it was just, you know, this little cap on my mouthpiece. So luckily I found the right saxophone. Um, today I thought it would be a nice topic because we are sitting already since weeks in our home office and spending time with maybe listening, hopefully listening to music. Um, but as maybe you have all your saxophones with you, we love or we would like to play a little bit right now. So a um, big thing is for me to improvise, to improvise. And some of you are maybe beginners, some of you are already advanced ones. And it's always good to pre repeat things or to really to start uh, with, with new with new adventures and that will be our first thing is just playing the saxophone without any sheet and just maybe um, find a, a place in your home where it's like um, not wooden but if you have a reverb a little bit mostly you find it in a bathroom so I would tell you just go there and make this ex experience to play in the bathroom which is wonderful so we just play um, long notes. Let's let's say it um, for the alto saxophone an A and for the tenor saxophone a D like Dora. <laughs> and then experience this sound in the bathroom. So the first note is alto saxophone an A, tenor saxophone a Dora D. Next one would be for alto saxophone a C. Combine these two notes. And you see, you have already a wonderful sound around you. Close your eyes that you can enjoy the sound. And the next one would be this note. Check it out when I'm playing. Try to play it. Okay, and the next one would be. So we have now four notes, and these four notes 
are really basic, but they are just beautiful if you play them in a nice room and or just in your in your in your working room in your at your computer on your uh, at your chair on the in the home office why not why not you can do it and um now let's play a little bit just everybody for yourself maybe like a few seconds <laughs> Okay, we have already four notes for alto a c d e and for tenor d like dora f like france uh, g germany a like austria yeah we have four notes so let's let's expand this then it will be <laughs> out this note I cannot hear you but I hope you can play it yeah <laughs> like, again okay and then we have this and backward Even watch what I'm playing. Have to stand up. Yeah, exactly. So this would be this would be um, a wonderful, um, wonderful number of nice notes. So I'm playing a little bit around and let's play for a while <laughs> Now I take the other notes in the lower part of the alto saxophone. So I'm playing this. Now I'm playing this, the lower note, which is the E, right. So I'm playing it E, D, C, yeah? E, D, C. For the alto saxophone, this is this like secret tips. No, no. <laughs> um, if you're playing this this one, this is the D. Actually, it's only for the high register you're using this 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 note, this this clap. And um, but it's wonderful sound if you're playing it in the in the lower part. It feels more um, more music wise. Let's see. Also more more jazzy it has another another uh, color of this note so basically we're just playing around with these notes you are on the octave which is in 
tenor saxophone the D, for alto saxophone the A. Make, sh make sure you're playing it very correct. Da 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 di, da da Playing it very correct and take um, a metronome, put your metronome on, let's say, 80 and play it really on time. Yeah, let's make this. And then it's already time to say goodbye for today. Let me see. Metronome. That, that's a nice, that's a nice thing for next week. We're talking about working on timing, working on your own rhythm feeling, on your own timing. This is again a big topic. I cannot explain everything here. Um, but you can book online lessons and I'm, and I'm happy um, to show you something around and, um, yeah, would love to meet you here. So if I, if I go on my metronome, this is just a little exercises. But there are different different times, uh, different types of playing in time. It's on time, it's laid back on time, it's on top. And what it is about, I could tell you for the next live streaming in one week, Tuesday, 5.30 European time. I hope I can meet you. So going back to my metronome, let's type it on eight. You can hear it. So this would be my metronome. So on time is this, as you maybe know. One more time. Two, three, four. Play it five times without mistakes and then Go on 90, go on 100, go on 110. Make your steps. So that was again my, I don't know, my third live stream on saxophone. I work a little bit on my microphone for the next few times and on the light. I have already a little bit light. I hope you can understand my English. Ich kann auch mal was in Deutsch für euch machen. But um, I love to see all the saxophone players from the whole world and English is there a good language to share. So I have a live chat as well here. As you can see, I'm pretty new. For the next five to 10 minutes, I'm still here on the live chat. Please, please ask stuff um, if you would like. And I'm happy um, to meet you next week. Stay healthy and um, have a nice adventure in your bathroom with your saxophone <laughs> or wherever you are. Enjoy saxophone playing. Bye bye.